Howdy guys, how we doing? Welcome back to another video of Westland Survival. How are we doing? Hope you guys well. So, today what I want to do is I want to head back out over to the uh, naturalist zone there so we can continue our little quest line. Now, what I want to show you before I get out there is I have actually upgraded my bait workbench to level 2 and I'm currently crafting tier 2 uh, Lynx bait. So for me, I'm doing the lynx uh, pathway, others might be doing the wolves, so you might find that the wolves uh, would be the number two bait when you do get to it. But at the moment, it is taking a while and it's weird because I actually started this yesterday. Don't know why it hadn't actually taken effect. I should have been at least another 12 hours ahead of this because the two day timer didn't effectively take, um, take hold until uh, midnight my time uh, last night so I don't know why that had happened um, hopefully there's some sort of explanation to that hopefully the, the developers can uh, shed some insight for that um, but yeah for now not too sure why that didn't happen but look it is what it is it's it's on the cook it's happening so we'll be able to get a level 2 links um, you know quite soon so right now we're gonna head over to the naturalist camp so let's go ahead and do that now um, so I submitted my um my tier one lynxes uh to the um uh, to the naturalists here so now we can actually uh, progress with the quest line i do have one that's still in the um in the pen at the moment um it is another raz so for those that were um uh, disappointed that i did let raz go i got myself another one so just to sort of put that out there guys so let's go over and have a bit of a chat so basically what I did was um, I handed it over to, to Vernon, all well and good. Now I've got to speak to Dr. Joy. Now just to give you guys a bit of context, um, here are the baits. I've already started onto tier three. Now I did actually want to have a look at this as well to see how this would play out. Now it only said I needed 10 points in order for me to get to the next, um, to the tier two, which I've already done. But as you can see, it's already seeped into the next quota, which is for uh, tier three. So you can uh, submit uh, level one uh, animals, and that would look like it'll appear to contribute to the um, uh, to the tier above the one that you've just gotten yourselves into. So in this case, for me, um, I, I got myself tier two. It's already started into tier three, and I actually used a tier one animal or pet, sorry, that I submitted. So. Hopefully that, um, th that will clear any confusion there. If you guys wanted to know that, now you know. And yes, there is different um, recipes as you saw before um, with the tier two. So you do need other materials in order for you to craft the uh, tier two bait. And then it's all gonna happen with the others, so on and so forth. And it looks like it's gonna take it by that uh, trajectory, uh, sorry, can't even talk. By that logic there, you will find that the higher the tier, the longer the wait you're going to need to wait for those baits to be crafted, and therefore for the um, uh, animal, sorry, for you to capture those new pets. But anyway, enough of rambling about that. Let's talk to Dr. J, sorry, Joy Rayleigh, and see what she's got to say. All right, so you became a frequent guest in our camp. No complaints, quite the opposite. I'm happy. Vernon and I have good news. First of all, still nothing's been heard about the poachers. And secondly, thanks to you, we finally created a formula for a new bait. Do you want to try it out? You deserved it. Besides, you might need a guardian, sorry, a guardian pet. Uh, yes, the poachers cannot be uh, discounted. If they decide to attack, we should be ready. Once you get a pet, bring it here. I can't wait to see the results of my hard work. So... Does that mean it's telling us to lure a tier two animal? Okay, and that's all that we've got to do here. So I've got to get myself a lynx. That's the next. That's the next step here. So, <coughs> excuse me. Now, actually, that's what I wanted to look at here. You've got um. Okay, wild boars. That's fine. Because there's bobcats out there, so I don't know if that would actually be the lynx that we're after. Because you got wildcat, you would think the next one would be a bobcat, right? That's what I would think. So we're definitely going to suss that out today. 
and it's telling us we're going to need to tier, uh, lure tier 2. Uh, so I'm assisting the railers again. The first task, make a bait using Vernon's formula and check if it works. If everything works out, you need to bring a tamed animal to the camp. So we're going to be doing that. So I'll be heading out. Ooh, what, what have I done? What I've completely messed myself up here. Hey, <laughs> Not good. Okay. So we're going to head out. Okay, so, oh, just on this as well, so I'm sure you guys would have been made aware about this by now, but the old road, apparently, according to the dev, uh, the devs there, they have committed to um, opening up the old road um, uh, timed event a lot more frequently. So hopefully you guys are going to get more um, opportunities to do the old road, get those bowls, and build up your... Um, uh, your pet pens there okay so hopefully that um, will happen for you guys soon hopefully it's already happened for some of those um, but for now um, that's the situation that we're in um, unfortunately I actually didn't quite get there with one of my runs which was really disappointing so I've only just got the one extra at the moment so I haven't seen anything else come through as of yet but for the purpose of this video I'm going to commit uh, to this we're going to spend the coinage there we go. So as you can see, this is the um, the bait formula that you need in order for you to do tier two. This would be uh, representative for if you were would have went for the uh, for the wolf, I'd imagine. So you got tier one, as you can see there, and then tier two. Beautiful. So at least we know exactly how that sort of works. So we're going to need to go ahead and lure a tier two animal. Actually, why am I running out of here? Let's go back and pick up the set bait. There we go. There really needs to be a bait uh, storage container, I reckon. And I reckon that's going to happen in some sort of update as well. I think that might be something that's going to be useful for the, um, for us. So that way we can put the workstation and the um, uh, storage container right next to it. So I don't think anything's happened uh, or that there's been any change in that. There's no storage for that. No, there is, isn't there? It doesn't look like it. So, yeah, okay. So yeah, I, I would recommend that should be something that should be done. Um, but yeah, anyway. So it's telling us we're going to lure a tier 2 animal. Now where do we go and find said tier 2? I think the dense forest is probably the probably the one way of doing it, I reckon. Actually, um, we're going to be using the horsey today. Because I'm low on, co on coins now, which is not good. And hopefully, it's the bobcat that we tame. I'm not sure. But I hope so. I don't know if they're found here, or do I have to go up the plateau? I think it could be the plateau. I could be wrong here. But we're going to suss it out. There's a lot of alpha wolves and things like that around here. There we go. Can be tamed. That's the bobcat. Okay, so... So, I guess it's the naming structure. For you guys that have gone down the uh, the Lynx uh, road that I have, it's the Bobcat that you're that you're after next. Now I don't think there's an um, there's an alpha version of this, which is uh, annoying. I don't think I've seen that to be honest with you. <coughs> Excuse me. And yeah, you've only got Cougars here, which is which belongs in a different family as well. So yeah, I don't understand. But other otherwise. We obviously can't tame those, but yeah, it's just just something to know. I don't know why it's one of those things. But then again, with the wolves, you've got the alpha line and then you've got the normal line as well. So I guess it is what it is. So there's a few of these guys here. I don't know who to take, but I'm just going to take one. So let's go ahead and do that. Use it. Do we get you? Yep. Okay. So same situation, guys. We've only got about a minute 25 before we, um, we lose the said pet. So we're going to need to make sure that we head over uh, to our ranch here. So we're going to um, quickly whisk our way over here. So it's done the right thing. It's effectively given us the, um, the, the notion to head back and to um, head over to our ranch, which we have obviously done now, which is good. So let's go ahead. Okay. So we've got a pet. It's called Guess. It's a common. Um, so here's the difference with the attack as well so it's a level 35 tier 2 um so wow five hours 
So it's going to take five hours for this thing to, to tame, which is crazy. And then um, 150 per day, uh, 35 attack, and we've got 365 in heals. So we're going to leave it as a guess. I'm just going to leave it anyway. I'm not going to bother with um, you know, making changes and stuff like that. So if I want to skip it, it's 164 to do so. Um, okay, fair enough. But it's going to take, how long? Five hours. That's crazy. Um, okay, so show the pet to Vernon. So we're going to have to take the pet over to Vernon. So here you go, guys. We got Raz back. Now, his max is only going to be up to level 25. So you can only go 10 higher. <coughs> Excuse me. With this, um, with the tier 2, I'm imagining it's going to be the very same thing as well. Um, it's going to be a level 45, I reckon. It's Probably it's going to go um, as high as... But um, yeah, that's basically it. I should probably uh, pop some food in there for all these fellas, so let's just do that. Um, okay, so yeah, so let's go ahead and take Guess with us. And yes, am I, um, am I burning through resources? I am, but you know what? For the context of, you know, content for you guys and for you guys to see exactly how this all sort of goes down, at least this is going to be your Bible, right? So I hope this is going to be your Bible that you guys can refer back to these videos and make sure that you guys are doing the right thing. You don't make any mistakes. That's that's what I don't want to happen for you guys, okay? So we're going to head over to the naturalist here. Um, we're going to submit our pet um, by the looks of things. So it is a bit of a disappointment. Um, but you know what? Before we go ahead and do that, I should probably take this fella out. We'll do a quick run, see how their, their attack and EXP goes as well. Um, so let's head over to the Oak Forest. So we'll do that. And we'll um, see how our little pet goes. So it's already waiting for us, which is kind of neat. Okie dokie. So what, what do we want to do? We want to find an animal. So let me just disengage, let's go boom, there you go, look at that, that was quick. And I'm just going to let Guess take him down, he's not doing too bad of an actual job if I'm being honest. As you can see the bleed effect already happened as well which is good. And you know what, we can just take that as well if we really wanted to. And then, yep, continue along the road. There we go. Take him out for me. Thank you very much. Did you drop anything? I'll take those. Why not? Yeah, there we'll do that. Let's do that. Okay, so the shooter is going to take take us on. So, <coughs> excuse me. We're going to be, um, yeah, we're, we're just going to be attacked, which is fine. I just want to see, see guests level up. And hopefully we might get a level up. I don't know. Gonna help the need. There we go. You're doing quite well, Guess. Doing good. So you can definitely see there's a bit of an uplift uh, in comparison to the T ones as well, which is kind of cool. Uh, you know, to actually see that. So yeah, it's um, it's quite nice. But like as we said, well as I said, the higher that you go, the more um, the vicious that they, these guys are going to go as they are anyway. All right. So I'm going to pop this on. And I'm just going to give Guess a bit of a hand. Okay, there you go. Oh, look at that! Only had one HP, and I managed to take him. Uh, Guess managed to take him out. So that should be some pretty good EXP too. There you go. Look at that. Oopsies. I hope Guess can um, take him out for me. Very good. And I got another Bobcat up me, um, at me as well, so... So far, Guess is doing good for me. You know, I can just keep running around, it's fine, it's, it's not too bad, the burglar's is going to die anyway. But I don't know if Guess has actually um, increased... ...in um, EXP, but anyway... But just so you guys can see, there we go. 
And you know what, I may as well see what was here anyway. Take a few things. Oop, take all that too. You know, basics, just grabbing all the basics and all that sort of good stuff. Alrighty, um, yeah, we'll just take that along with us. Why not? And we've got another destroyer here. Okay, so I guess we'll be able to take that out, take him out for me. And of course, wouldn't allow me to, um, there we go, open up the chest here. Alright, ooh, look at that. Oh, that was, that was a good find. I'm glad that I, um, opened up that. That's good, good, good. Okay, you know what? I think we've done enough here. I think we're going to head, head pack and we'll go to the naturalist uh, camp. So apologies, but I just wanted to sort of give a bit of a squeeze and see exactly how that um how that sort of looked, which was good. At least you guys get a bit of an idea as well. I mean, like I said, I've got I've got various amounts happening um, or or baits happening as well, so it'll be fine. I'm not too fussed. Okay, okay. So let's go and submit young guess. Okay, so Vernon, just look how beautiful this animal is. It means the formula works. We'll soon begin inhabiting the nature park with rare animals. My dear, I just saw someone over there in the distance. Here we go. Here we go. And I don't have... I don't have the HP for this. Well, that was quick. <laughs> that was short-lived, wasn't it? So much death, so much blood. Why the hell won't poachers just leave us alone? Uh, does the nature park haunt them that much? Or our... I, our Albino Ch uh, Charles, I don't know what that is. I guess your, I guess both your theories are correct. My, my darling, I have something to cheer you up. One of the poachers had a map. It marks the location of their lair. Ooh, there's a lair involved. Here we go. This is our chance to free our stolen animals. Please save them. Joy and I will wait for you here. Take care and good luck. Oh, okay, thanks guys. Um, I appreciate that. You know you. Um, well, look, we don't necessarily need to give the animal, but as you can see here, tier two is going to give us an extra 20. So, what are we? We're, we're level 37. So we picked him up, we picked her up, sorry, at level 35. So two levels up, we've got 20 points that we can drop into here. We do the math, it's basically going to take us, um, what, what is that? Um, it's going to take us at least 15, no, 30? No. No, about 15, yeah. It will take about 15 animals that we're going to need to submit to get to a tier 3, which is going to be a while. And we're going to uh, lower lynxes up to level 55, which is crazy. So, I guess you can do it in one or two ways. I, I get, I'd imagine it's probably going to take the same amount of time anyway, or... You know what? It's probably going to be quicker with the um, with the tier ones when you think about it because we know it takes a day for the bait to be crafted and then from there it takes 50 about an hour for the animal to be tamed <coughs> excuse me now where whereas in this situation the this links here said six hours six hours for that to be tamed without spending coin because I'm all about um, making sure that it's all free to play. Mind you, everything that I've done was not via any method of um, uh, assistance from the developers or anything like that. Um, they only just helped out with the bowls that kickstarted off this series. So just wanted to be clear with that. But what I'm trying to say is it's going to take six hours for the links to be tamed at your base. It's going to take two days just for the bait to come to, uh, to be applied, uh, sorry, to be crafted before you can actually go ahead and use it. So. With that being said, it's going to take longer for you to do it that way with the um, with the tier two. Whereas you may as well just do the tier one, tame as much as you can, submit them in, and then that'll contribute to your um, uh, your your bait. Okay, so your research points. So I think that's probably probably going to be the most appropriate way of doing it. What I'm going to do though is I'm going to try and max out guests here. So I'm not going to submit guests today. I'm going to hang on to her. And we know it's 20. So I want to see what it looks like when we max her um, experience, her levels, and see if that changes it. If it changes it and if it's a lot more, then it could be tangible. Who knows? 
but I think it might be still quicker doing it with T1. I don't know what that's going to look like when we go to, say, T3 bait and, and get ourselves a T3 pet. Who knows? But at least this way you guys are aware of how this works and, and you've got the idea what my thoughts are. Now, with the Poacher's Lair, it's not going to be anything that we're going to need to um, worry about in terms of... Um, timing or anything like that so i'm not going to do it in this video i'll do it in the next video just so you guys are aware but i just wanted to make this one here um, so at least this way you guys have got an exposure to tier 2 pets and how the part of this quest line works as well so hopefully you guys enjoyed this one please hit that like button comment down below you guys have been doing that for the previous three videos it's been amazing so thank you thank you thank you so much for being a part of this and uh, submitting your thoughts and showing the love so continue to do that because it really helps me out as well um, and if you haven't done so already make sure you hit that subscribe button and that notification bell icon so you don't miss out on any future videos if you're able to share if you can so at least this way others can see this as well and we can get more exposure to these videos as well anyway guys i'm out of here thanks for, for watching and i'll catch you guys in the next one